What's up guys, it's Brian again from Lake Hickory Scooby Marina. I want to make a quick video on why I am a big advocate of the My SSI app and why you should be using it. Whether you're an SSI diver or not, you can still be utilizing some of the great features. We're going to talk about training manuals, dive courses, we're going to talk about dive logs, we're even going to talk about where do you keep all your certifications at. Do you keep a hard card book like I do here or do you actually use a digital certification card? So let's take a quick look at the app and I'll talk about all these features and why I really like them. All right, guys, this is the main home screen of the app here. As you can see, there's a lot of features built into it. It's very easy to read. There's a menu button here where we can go and change things if we need to. We can change between training courses, our cards, our dive logs, all that. But first, you want to go to the App Store and download the app. So just go to My SSI, type it in, do a quick download for it, and then bring up the app. Now, we'll ask for a login. To do that, simply go to our website, lakehickerscuba.com, and click on the SSI login and this is where you can get your login put in your information it'll send you a quick email with a login data both a login and a password and then you can log into the app once you reopen it now once there you can go to the settings and you can change settings you can change all your personal settings you can change the layout you can change it whether you want metric or imperial system however you want to learn you can change and set it up to fit your needs now from the home screen there's a lot of good information here but we're going to look at these menus if we go over to pro programs and cards you will see all the different programs SSI has to offer. Um, now, when you first log in, you won't have all these different programs. You'll actually have to register for them. This is where your SSI facility comes into play. You also have all your digital cards. Anything that you're certified in will be here as well. Now, let's say that you are not an SSI certified diver. You're certified through another agency. The SSI facility can actually put those cards in as well. Now, you won't get an image with those cards, but what that will allow is it will give you access to any training material for a class that you're already certified through another training agency as well. So if those uh, courses don't come up but you're already certified through another agency, have your SSI facility put it in there and those courses will come up. If you go over to the tables tab, you'll see that there's all different types of tables for rescue diver. You got your five minute neuro exam, you got your dive tables here, which makes it very easy to read. You can zoom in on them. You don't have to carry them plastic tables with you anymore. You got everything on your phone. You got your CNS clock, your equivalent air depth. Everything is there for you. So it's a great little feature, um, great information. Now, if we go over to the dive logs, we've actually made a video on this before uh, of how you can enter in your dives. And there's three different ways. You can do a manual input, a computer download, or you can scan a QR code from a buddy as well. But I'll link that video down in the description below and up here at the top of the screen. You can very easily watch that as well. If you switch over to the the SSI partner link. Now I really like this because it's a map link. It's going to show you all your dive sites. It's also going to show you the SSI facilities based off your geographical location and you can simply just zoom in. Uh, and if I just show you some here, what you're seeing here, anything in black is dive sites that I've actually went out and dove. And so when I put those dives in my dive log, it's automatically going to match those. And you can also do this via GPS when you're at the dive site as well. You can kind of document it. So it's pretty easy to keep up with your dive sites, find new dive sites to dive at, and find local SSI facilities. If you want to switch over to satellite mode, you can do that as well. Um, and that way you can kind of zoom in. You can see entry points, exit points. You can see kind of what the water condition is as well. So that's a really neat feature that's built in there. Um, but yeah, all in all, this is a great app. It's just a lot to it. Uh, it does take a little getting used to, but it's free, guys. Whether you're an SSI diver or not, you can very easily download this from the App Store. Just simply type in My SSI. And you want to make sure that you get the right app. So type in My SSI, there'll be two that comes up. You want the black and red logo, which is the top one there. Just simply click on it, download it, and then of course you want to make sure you go to our webpage, go to the login for SSI to get your login information, and then they'll send you an email with all your information to log into the app. So guys, it is a great app. Any diver, whether you're an SSI diver or not, should be using the SSI app. So there you go guys that's why we really like this app it's a great resource for you even if you're not an SSI diver it's still going to be good for you not only can you put all your certifications from other agencies in there as well it's also going to allow you their training courses that's the equivalent to what you're certified in so when your book kind of goes out of date about every two years these books kind of go out of date the information doesn't but there's always new information that's added to it all you've got to do on that digital system is just simply re-download that program and you're going to 
to have updated information. You can also use it to compare between agency to agency and see which one has a better training program as well. You'll always have that. It never goes away. And even without internet access, you're still going to have it once you download it. Guys, once again, it's a free download. It's just the My SSI app on the App Store. You can simply go over to our webpage, which is just lakehickoryscuba.com, and click on the profile link. It'll take you to SSI to get your profile information. But guys, I really appreciate you watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, smash that like button for me and do me another huge favor and share it. Every time you guys share our videos, it helps us out more than you could ever imagine. But guys, if you got any questions, please put it down in the comment section below. As always, guys, make sure you follow us on Instagram and Twitter. Like us on Facebook. Pin us on Pinterest. Subscribe to us here on YouTube. And as always, guys, we appreciate your business. Guys, we really appreciate you watching our videos. If you liked it, make sure to give us a big thumbs up. If you're not a subscriber, simply hit that subscriber button for us and make sure you hit the little bell to turn on all notifications. If you want to see some other cool videos, make sure to click these links here. They could be scuba tips, they could be diving videos, search and recovery videos, or gear reviews. Once again, guys, we really appreciate it.